Hi. Uh, I thought I'd show you a uh, quite interesting 78 RPM record that I uh, won some time ago on an internet auction. Uh, I rarely bid on um, internet auctions when it comes to 78 RPM records because, well, you have to really know how to pack these records to make sure that they will uh, get to their new owner in one piece. Uh, still, uh, the person who sold this record had a good record on good record, ha ha ha, on Tradera. So, um, and this record was so special that I really felt that oh, I really want this. Uh, so I decided to bid on it, and I uh, managed to win it. And I got it some uh, days ago, and it was perfectly packed, perfectly packed. So, uh, cheers to him. Well, what? kind of record am I talking about? Well, this is uh, from 1950, Musica, which, which is the um, record company, uh, Toto game, uh, a gallop uh, horse racing game on one side, and uh, the tips of the football game on the other side. And what's this all about? Well, um, this record has got several several grooves on each side that uh, goes parallel, and depending on where you put down your needle, you can you hear a different groove. So uh, this total game, you can uh, there are five grooves um, with five different races. Four, uh, well, most of them are almost identical until the last seconds when you find out who of these four horses uh, who win who will win if it's horse number one horse number two horse number three or horse number four um, so you can actually make a bid uh, on which uh, horse uh, will win and there's no chance that you'll be able to find out where to drop your needle to be able to know uh, which horse will win because as you see the label is uh, designed in a way that it looks the same from uh, every different different angle uh, the playing time on each track isn't that long around 30 seconds maybe uh, and it's extra short on this uh, Toto the uh, horse rate racing side because it's uh, five different tracks uh, each around 30 seconds maybe um, four horses five tracks well what about the fifth track well there's a false start too <laughs> so and when it's a full start you just have to take up your pickup and put it in the start of the record again uh, on the other side uh, it's a football game between Sweden and Denmark and you can bid whether it will be uh, Sweden will do the um, uh, uh, goal and win whether Denmark will score, or whether it will be a draw, 0-0. Zero, zero. And you can use this if you want to uh, uh, bid on other matches uh, as well, games as well. Uh, I think the horse racing side is the most exciting one, but it's quite interesting. It's, it, this must be a very rare record. And the sleeve has got the rules printed, and also uh, where you can uh, put your different bids. You have both the first place and the runner-up. Uh, it isn't mentioned on this uh, record uh, who the uh, speaker is, but it's a man called Inimar Pali. I managed to find out that. Uh, and I thought, well, what about trying this? Uh, I, we have four horses and I think I will bid on horse number three. All good things are three. So I bid on horse number three. Let's see how it goes. All right, remember I bid it on uh, number three. So let's see, now the, uh, the speaker will of course do his quick talking in Swedish. But I will tell you whether I won or not. And if there are any Swedish listeners, they'll be able to tell me whether I've cheated or not. Okay, go, horse three. Yeah. 
I won. The narrator first thought that it was number one, but then he said, no, I was mistaken. It was horse number three. I won. Great. Yeah, great fun. And, well, I was lucky this time. How about trying the football side too? Sweden against Denmark. Who will win? Well, Sweden, of course. Of course. So, go Sweden! Well, one cannot be lucky all the time. Denmark won. Well, it's a fun record anyway. And hope you enjoyed this little video. Bye bye.